Hello, and from the staff of Moab Jeeper Magazine, I'm George Pandoff. I'd like to welcome you back to another edition of Moab Jeeper Tool Bag. In our previous episode, we discussed the various sockets we use here at Moab Jeeper Magazine, but left one out, the industrial socket. Now the industrial socket is what we would call the better mouse trap. Sure, many have tried to build a better mouse trap, but as of yet, no one has truly succeeded. Well, in the world of building a better socket, Industro has done what mousetrap engineers could not. Now, I'm sure that you probably don't mind spending money for a quality tool. So let's get to the bottom line before we go into all of the capabilities of these sockets, and that is cost. This set of industrial sockets, due to their unique, patented cut, will do the work of both standard and metric sockets. So for half the investment, you get twice the tool. But we said these sockets will do six times the work. Now some of these other fasteners I'm about to go over, you may not recognize. For those that do, here are some additional savings. First up is the RIBE. This one is used on Nissans, Fiat, Porsche, and a number of other vehicles, particularly for the head of an engine. But to give you an example of the cost savings by owning this one set of sockets, a search online for a single RIBE socket to a Nissan was listed at $15. This next bolt shown here, the 8-point, is supposedly still in use. So if you're that person that is familiar with this bolt head, these sockets are for you. Unlike the 8-point, we have seen the external Torx, also called an inverted Torx, used on some occasions. For example, a Dana 35 rear axle. Now we're going to get old school and cover square nuts and bolts. I can't remember the last time I've actually saw one and they seem to be fading away. But these sockets will speed up an otherwise tedious and slow job with a wrench. This particular bolt, the spline bolt, is still used in many applications. If you're not already familiar with this bolt, it's unlikely you will come upon them. However, if you do work with spline bolts, these sockets save you the expense of buying a very unique and specific tool set that has no other use. The last of these unique bolt heads is the 12 point. And if you've ever turned wrenches on a race car, there is a good chance you will have worked with these bolts. So there it is. These sockets work with standard and metric nuts and bolts and six other not so common types of fasteners. But now I want to wrap this up by telling you about a feature that we really appreciate here at Moab Jeeper Magazine, and that is removing bolts and nuts suffering from rock rash. A six point may not fit with the nut or bolt head being deformed from rock abrasions. A 12 point may apply too little pressure to the flats of a nut or bolt and round the corners. Industrial sockets find the happy medium and will work on a nut or bolt with up to 30% of the corners rounded off, or in our world, grounded off by rocks. For many of you, this won't be the first time we have shown you industrial sockets. However, what is new is the source for purchasing these great sockets, HB Distributors. You can read our full review and link straight to this excellent product by visiting us at moabjeeper.com search word industrial sockets or HB distributors can be reached toll free 800-266-3478 or visit them on the web at hbdistributors.com well that wraps it up for another edition of Moab Jeeper tool bag I'm George Pandoff and from all the staff of Moab Jeeper magazine we hope to see you on the trails of Moab